Hello everyone, this is ZeroZef, and this is Metal Slug Defense. I believe this is the iOS port of the game to PC on Steam. It is free, which probably means that it's gonna have its microtransactions, but we're gonna start anyway. Um... Uh, can I not do easy? Well, okay. Um, mission start. Let's go. Mission start! Yep. Okay. Um, tap. Okay, we're gonna tap an icon. Uh, I personally don't have a touchscreen monitor, so I guess I'll have to click on things. Um, but you need AP, shown below, to start a unit. Hold on until AP builds up. Okay, I'm just gonna sit here. Uh, tap, again, or time for a unit to sortie. Tap an icon below. Um, so, okay, so this is just another lame D. That's fine. Um, press space, I think? Oh, no, no, actually click the person. Okay. Um, okay. Metal slug. Um, to how do I? Um, okay, well, I saved the prisoner, okay. Uh, and I will save prisoners of war. All right, that's all good. New unit gained. Um, login bonus. Okay. Looks like that's the regular currency. Okay. Um, present of... The premium currency. That's fine. Okay, mini Jupiter King. Yeah, whatever. Okay, cool. We got lots of free stuff. Um, let's look at the customization. Uh, unit customize. Um, how do I... Oh. Oh, okay. I have to slide it as if I'm... Uh, using a touch screen, I guess. Yeah, because that makes sense on PC. These arrows lie, actually. You can't actually click on those. Uh, you can't actually click on this side either. You actually have to literally slide it across every time. Um, which one's the... Okay, uh, we're gonna power it up. We're just gonna, like, just power up the soldier. Yeah, oh, max. He's on max now. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we'll go back, and, uh, no, we'll just go back all the way, uh, and do a sortie. Um, is this stamina? I think this is stamina. Um, so I guess the game doesn't want me to play in a little bit, but that's okay. Uh, we'll go to stage two. Mission start! I mean, I don't want to play this game either, so I guess um, we'll just go stand over here. We'll speed it up. We'll speed up production. Uh, send this guy out. Increase production by a lot. Well, I guess you can just win with one guy. That that works too. Mission complete. Yeah, engaging. So sweet. New stage. I hope so. Uh, so this is stamina. That's interesting. Uh, stamina in a free to play Mission game. Start. Uh, don't think that's too great for a game like this. It's actually quite annoying. Uh, we'll try to get this my resources up ASAP. Throw that up. They have a tank, but that's okay. We'll just spam units now.
We have some problems. Um, I don't know how to blend this. Use supplies. Oh. Okay, so it's showing me the, uh, thing I have to pay for. That's fine. Thank you. That's cool. Um, so we're just gonna level up my stuff again. Ooh, I won! As soon as, like, the premium currency came in. That's great. Um, D rank, because I didn't lose fast enough for me to show, uh, for it to show me how to actually win that. But apparently that was unwinnable. That's great. That's what I really want to see. I will have to say, though, I have played this game on um, iOS itself, and I don't remember it being this bad. I do not remember remember it being that way. Um, I remember it remember it actually being pretty decent, um, and not like this at all. So it's actually kind of weird for me to see if like this pay to win with a single unit. Um, I mean, because a single unit wins them all, right? Let's put out one unit. I mean, why why use a lot of other units when a single unit beats the mission, right? Um, looks like I got two prisoners. That's cool. Prisoners of war. Shop can now be used. Deck can be edited. VS can be, um, stuff that I don't actually care for. Okay. Um, we'll do a couple more and then I think I will just shoot myself from how bored I am. Uh, looks like all my stamina returned Mission on that screen, start. but I think we have to see it now. Um, we're gonna do the same thing as always. Always get our economy, okay. our sparkling economy up. And toss the grenade. Okay. Level it up. I don't know what this guy does, though. Okay. Well, I mean, this is GG, I guess, right? Because I have two people out this time, not just one. Mission yes. Complete. Mission complete. I'm so happy. Excellent. Alright. Um, let's just skip to stage four. Mission start. Yep. Okay, we're gonna slide over here. Wait for it. And this button, click here. Okay. Okay. Why use any other unit?
I mean, I guess I can use, like, these giant ones for hilarity. Like, this crab walker kind of thing. It's a hermit crab. Okay. Like, it just walked right into that. It's kind of a little bit jarring how detailed, like, this robot is compared to the rest of the game. Uh, like, look at these textures. Like, you can literally see the textures. Um, this port isn't that great. Uh, new prisoner of war. What do these do? Character abilities. Um, like, the pixel, like, the quality of this image versus these sprites is a bit jarring. Um, let's look at how the shop, what the shop's like. How much does any of this stuff cost? Um, sale on items. Okay, so this is value set. Val quote unquote value. Um, 300? How much does, uh... How much does the currency cost? Is the question. Now, I don't know how much the currency costs. Yeah, I know, but I, I want to know how much this currency costs. Um... Right. Um, I don't know how much the items cost. I need a hundred more medals. What does the- how much do the medals cost? These are things I do not know. Uh, I mean... I remember on the iOS game that um, it was like 10,000 for like 5 bucks. So it's about 10,000 of these medals. So um, it's a bit. They give you a bit, but... Uh, uh, this isn't the good this is this is not the best iOS port um there are I hope there are better soon but this is not an example of how to um, get the PC market to be interested in the iOS ports um, some of them are okay but this is not one of them anyway this has been this is Azure's F and this is metal slug defense uh, free on Steam if you're really interested in it. I don't know why. It is stuttering in the background, though. That is an interesting thing. Oh, okay. There we go. It's moving again. Um, and as well, see you guys next time. Hey guys, this is after the recording. Um, I totally forgot that there was downloadable content for this game, and these are the prices that, uh, they originally are. I mean, at the time of recording, it's on half off right now. So all the prices here are the ones that uh, are all at 50% off. So let's look at all these other ones. There is the KOF pack and all these ones. That one's normally 30 bucks. Right now it's $14.99. Uh, let's just talk about it at, um, at uh, full price. This one there... Um, for 30 bucks, you can get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12 characters. Uh, 12 characters for this game. Uh, not sure that's quite worth it. But, if you get... Uh, you can see that add all DLC to cart. So, um, if you were to get all of this, you would pay... Uh, if it wasn't on sale right now, you would pay $174.80, $175. Bucks. Um, don't quite think that's worth it for this game. I can't imagine anyone really buying all of that. I mean, that's not, that's probably not even worth it. Um, of all the Metal Slug games, I don't think this one, uh, it's unfortunate that this one was the one to make it onto Steam. Um, because I don't really think Steam needs a game like this. Um, that's I noticed in the reviews and comments that um, 
that's how other people feel also that they're kind of disappointed that this is the metal slug to get onto steam uh, i can't imagine that the, um i can't imagine and i do have the experience that this game is actually pretty okay on ios um compared to other ios games this is actually pretty fair uh these packs are ridiculous but um the download dlc for this the pc version is ridiculous but um the ones on S ios is actually not that bad um it's a little bit cheaper i believe on ios but these ones are a little bit higher for whatever reason um maybe they assume that they can't nickel and dime us as much but um it is fun it, it's not bad it's a bit it, it's again like one of those lame defenses which where you don't really need to put much thought um actually throughout the recording i was actually a bit try hardy but for the most part it's not too bad but unfortunately i don't think the audience for that is here on steam and if it was i don't think they would do the free to play version maybe like a dollar or two um if you make it like that instead of doing this download dlc kind of thing to um y this game would be much more popular than it was now those interesting units though like the crab tank it's growing on me <laughs>